James Savalski back here for EA Sports. Well, the battle lines were drawn in game one. What's in store for game two of this series? The officials there at center and I... Not a must win, but I don't want to lose. Leafs and Red Wings game two. An early off. Oh, that's a nice takeaway from Wallman. Leafs were getting something going, but a nice stick from... Jake Wallman is Dylan Larkin is in. He crashes in, and that goes wide. Early chance for Larkin using the speed. We've got Ben Sherratt back in the lineup, which is huge because we're out most cider until the 30th of April. To brink it with a wrist shot. Saved again, Samsonov. Two early saves. That's dumped in by Nylander. In and around Jake Wallman. Don't have a winger over there. Now we're going to fire this up to Patrick Kane, but read well by Marner. Jesus Christ, what a pass to Marner. Marner looks, finds Klinkberg, drags. Matthews in tight. May have been a penalty, I'm not sure. No. Kane in and around. They step up on Kane. What a takeaway from Mitch Marner. He stops, finds Klinkberg. Now Tavares can't get it through traffic. Larkin will skate it up. Unfortunately, we got Jake Wallman leading this rush. We'll play it into, oh, Dabrinkit had a nice chance. Raymond circles around, drops it back to Mata. Shot will miss wide, and Mata will retrieve it for the Red Wings. Now a long one up to Raymond, and oh man, are the Leafs sniffing. Long passes out. Kampf going to get crushed by Mata. Gostas Bear back up the boards. It's in behind Mata, but he's got it now. Mata finds Raymond. Wrist shot blocked away. Toronto seems to be playing even better here early in this one than they did in game one. Big hit from Mata. Now out wide to Comfer. The only problem is we get closed in on. Morgan Riley. Finding Yarncrow. Now back to Liljegren. That got through McIsaac. And McIsaac taken away by a number, number 11. In comp. Gostas Bear up to Sprong. He gets hit. But Fabry in close behind. Robbie Fabry in front. And Samsonov keeps it out again. Stalemate here in the early stages. Nice poke check from Sprong. He's in there on Domi, but can't get it away. Yarncroke dispossessed. Fabry over to chase it down. Did not play that where he wanted to. Game locked the pass on to Jared McIsaac. And now it's Robbie Fabry. In around Liljegren. He's got a chance, but dispossessed. How in the world? McIsaac to Fabry. Gonna have to play that around the boards. Bergren circling. Oh, there was a lane. Somebody got a stick on it. It's up and out of play. Teams are lined up and we are ready to take this draw. Third line out here. In full now. Timmons, nice poke check Rasmussen, but Timmons gets around. Lafferty on McIsaac, dumped in. Justin Hole will retrieve. Long one off the boards. Joe Valeno didn't get there as cleanly as I would have liked. And that was to a cutting burger, and I wanted that to Rasmussen. Poke checked away. Big Ras looking for separation. And he's got it for the time being in around the boards. It'll be handled by Joe Valeno, who turns, takes a tough angle shot, gets his own rebound. Back to Mata. Saves Samsonov again. Could be a goaltending day if things keep up like this. Halfway through the first, nobody's been able to break the ice just yet. Giordano looking for somewhere to go with it. That's a nice stick out of JT Comfer, and JT Comfer is around the veteran Giordano. Going to look in front, couldn't find Raymond. It went through to Perron. And now Nylander on Gostisbehere. Gostisbehere got a stick on it. And the shot from Nylander blocked away, but it's still with him. Poked away again. Perron moves to Olimata, but he's in a box. <clears throat> I'm trying to pass that puck off. 
to the middle of the ice as they're crowding us. But right now, just no space. David Perron. I don't have a defender back there. That's a trip and a Red Wing power play. Mitch Marner to the box. What's going on, Pat? Happy Monday? Happy Monday is a thing? Been a while since I said that. Not sure what Marner expected there. Larkin can't win it. It's Lily Agrin, but give it away. Patrick Kane, Rasmussen, tip shot. Debrinkit got taken away by Brody. Jesus. Oh, Gambrell with a nice cut. Gets it past the blue line. Dumped off to Debrinkit out wide. Kane is still offside, and Rasmussen into the bench. But here's the speed of Larkin. Going to pass it across. Kane scores, and it's 1-0. Patrick Kane's first playoff goal is a Red Wing. And Jesus Christ, I don't know what happened on that pass if it went off of a Leafs defender, but the speed of Larkin makes this play. Draws in two defenders. Looked like that pass had something go a little bit wrong with it, but it's in past Samsonov, and we've already equaled. Already equaled our goal total from game one. Larkin and Rasmussen on the assists. And now Jared McIsaac as we're back to even strength. Going to play it to the middle. Tried to go to Kane. But now Kane in close again. Debrinkin tries to stuff it home and it won't go. Klinkberg up to Tyler Bertuzzi. Had, of course, the deke in game one that shouldn't have ever happened. McIsaac with a long one up to Dylan Larkin. And his speed's going to get a chance again. Kane checked up on the play. Back to the point and hole. Now McIsaac through traffic, rang the goal post. Fabry across, Larkin turns, fires, tip shot. And Bertuzzi gets it up to Tavares. If we uh start, if the Broncos start winning with Zach Wilson, we know it's a New York Jets problem. Plinkberg, back to Domi. Red Wings got something on that. See, see, those are the animations I just can't stand. Oh, my goodness, what a pick by Klingberg. And here, now here's Domi. Tried the Forsberg. Didn't work. Fabry doesn't have an option, but Andrew Kopp. But Andrew Kopp's around. Going to try and drop it off to Sprong in the pass. Not where it needed to be. Long one from Sprong. Morgan Riley with it in behind. Long one up to Domi and now Yarncroak, who's around Sprong. Pin to the boards, trying to be patient with it. Only Mata has it. And up to David Perron, who's around Klinkberg. He'll turn to the front. Saved by Samsonov. Oh, man. That felt like 2 nothing. Cannot lie. Six face-off win for the Maple Leafs to our one. Nylander gets clobbered by Ole Mata. And now Mata with the puck, but he gets poke-checked away. Now Brody. Good thing Mata turned back. Matthews. Somebody got a stick on it. That's blocked by Perron. Give that off to Lucas Raymond, who's in around. Raymond can't score. <clears throat> Mata tried to get a stick in there as there's just a cluster. Comfort gets into Gostas Bear. Now it's Mitch Marner. Leafs reach in behind for the puck. Who saw the save? <clears throat> Intercepted by Matthews to the middle and Brody. Another nice red wing stick. Oh, God damn. Michael Rasmussen is around Timothy Lilligren. Long strides. Checks somehow, some way. Gambrell, four seconds to go. Lafferty, odd angle shot. A save from Husso will play it to the corner, and the period ends. Larkin and Matthews again. Restart period number two, and the second faceoff win for the Red Wings. Ben Sherratt going to flip that around. Kane should be back to get it. Finds Jake Wallman off a of body. 
Nice change in direction for Morgan Riley. A guarantee leaves possession for the time being. Matthews dumping it in. Over to Brinkett. To Wallman in the corner. Around to Kane. He's got to come all the way around to find Alex to Brinkett. Who holds off. Larkin comes over. Sets a little bit of a distraction. Back to Kane. And a save from Samsonov again. Ilya Samsonov made plenty of spectacular saves in game one. 30-some shots against. Leafs a little confused. We'll dump that off. Comfer up in the air. Perron up against the boards. Puck squirts free, but it's still with David Perron. Over to Wallman. Missed the net. Raymond. Wallman again. Off a body in front. A Red Wing body. And that was David Perron. Riley looking for somewhere to go. Eventually finds a backskating Marner. Now Matthews and Klinkberg brings it to center. Or he dumps it in. In the direction of Wallman. Changes for the Leafs. Long one up to Comfort. He's got Perron. Saw that coming. But Perron able to get free. Olimata, odd shot. Samsonov has to make the save. And now we just hope Comfort's all right. I believe he is. Back up. Can't afford to take too many more injuries. <clears throat> Especially to defensemen. Already outsider. We're out Petrie. We're out who was our reserve defenseman in Simon Edvinson. Andrew Kopp. Red Wings just trying to work their way up the ice. Kopp in around. Kopp got to send that in around. Sprong gets stuck on the net. And it's with Toronto's comp. Up to Tyler Bertuzzi. Watch out for the deke of no physical sense. Costas Bear can't get it up. Tavares finds Liljegren loose in front of the net. Robbie Fabry a little evasive action. Finding Olimata. They crouch in again and over to Daniel Sprong. Sprong will turn. Try to drop it back to Costas Bear. Funny one. <coughs> Andrew Kopp keeps it in. Played to Sprong. Shot won't go. Watch out for the pass across. It's exactly what they tried to do. Debrinkit fighting through, but eventually Yarncroke wins out. Bad step from Mata. Mata's got the puck. Mata shoved into the goaltender there. And now a pass up to Larkin. Gonna drop it back. Debrinkit, wrist shot. Save again, Samsonov. Justin Hole in the middle of the ice. Another blocker save. Larkin can't get it off of Brody. I don't know if Debrinkit got rocked at some point. <clears throat> Where's the puck? Jesus Christ, all of a sudden it's been Justin Hole. Hole to the middle, finds Larkin. He gets immediately knocked down. <clears throat> Debrinkit, maybe out of gas, made a nice play, but now it's with Nylander. Back to Marner, somebody got a stick on it. Nylander to Domi, through traffic, won't go. Hole up the boards, Debrinkit. <clears throat> out wide, Larkin, he's out of gas as well. Tried to cross. Defender cut in. This could be bad. Especially if my own teammates are setting more picks on me. Nylander in front. Rasmussen with a hit. Timmons to Giordano to Nylander. McIsaac got a stick on it. It's Nylander in tight. Shot is blocked from Austin Matthews by Jared McIsaac. Bergeron, little floaty backhander. Saved again, Samsonov. Bertuzzi, cross ice, Giordano. Watch the trailer. Well, we poked it to the trailer. Busso makes the save. Not really sure how Tyler Bertuzzi keeps doing it. Defies physics again. <clears throat> Guess who's closest to the puck? The Red Wing. Guess who, the, guess who touched the puck? The Maple Leaf, who was able to phase through the Red Wing. Sherratt will get it up. Lucas Raymond. Raymond in around. He's going to get clobbered. Valeno, no, that's Wallman tried to come in and did. Comfer still with it for Detroit. Sherratt through traffic up over the net. Corralled by Perron. 
Around in front. Oh my goodness, what a save. Comfer moves it to Goss Despair. To the middle, no. Take it away, Morgan Riley. Oh my goodness, Perron had an empty net. Oh, there's a deke from Comp. Watch out the other way, Morgan Riley. Red Wings get a change in. It's a block shot from Sprong, but it bounces all the way back to Tavares. Comp now Riley. Their passing is scaring me now. <clears throat> in front, yeah, matter of time. <clears throat> Yeah, when the AI is allowed to pass like that, they're scoring. It doesn't matter. They pass quicker than the human ever could hope to because the game's input is just not fast enough. One one. Halfway through game two, two goals in this series for Detroit, four for Toronto, and power play Toronto. <coughs> Second penalty on Robbie Fabry this series. How in that cluster do you see that? Also, how is that even possible that one guy gets slashed that Stick would have had to go right in between two players? Cop wins it. McIsaac sends it down. Jared McIsaac, for his low overall, has uh, played a fairly solid defensive game, defensive couple games for us, but there's a long one up to Marner. Move to Nylander. A very dangerous power play. Hold ascend at the distance. Matthews finding Marner over to Nylander to Matthews. Here's William Nylander. Matthews the shot and Nylander shoves it in. He just kept moving in on goal and apparently never touched the goalie in Billy Husso. William Nylander scores and makes it 2-1 Toronto. And, I mean, McIsaac makes another play. Matthews corrals it right back. How is that not goalie interference? He's, he's all over him. I could not tell you. Face off one by Toronto. Dumped in. Mata. I, Goss Despair is in my, in my fucking way. <clears throat> That's off the stick of Marner, or skate rather. Kane stepped up, nasty hit, but guess what? The other 88 and William Nylander read that incredibly well. We have another, what? I'll also have it known that any penalty we've taken in the, the first two games of this series, I haven't done. I haven't, I'm not stick lifting, I'm not doing anything but poke checking that could get us penalties and the AI has done it to me for a second time in about two minutes. Rasmussen with a face-off win. Mata sends it around to Berger and who gives it right to Klinkberg. Aiming run on the boards. Instead it goes right to a Maple Leaf. Yarncroak just got destroyed by Sherratt but it might not matter. In front still loose. Sherratt Husso plays it to Mata. Rasmussen sends it the distance. Yarncroft. McIsaac got a stick on it. Bergren across. Rasmussen a snipe. Glove save. Samsona. Man, if we could get a shorthanded goal, it could be huge. Cops ready for the draws. They will continue to try to kill off this penalty. Face off win from Cop. It's poked away from Hole. Hole pinned to the boards, and here comes Yarn Croak now. Domi. Domi in tight. Where's the pockets with Huso? Given to McIsaac. McIsaac will send it the distance. A dangerous play. But I saw we had an opening. Tyler Bertuzzi. 
Up to Domi. Sent down by Valeno. What is that pass? And how did that work? Here is Tavares. Off the skate of hole. Hole. Ah, yeah. Extendo stick from Nylander. Andrew Kopp makes a play, and McIsaac cuts up ice. He's going to get clobbered, but it's Andrew Kopp with the shot right into Sam Sonoff. I feel like our shot accuracy is worse than ever. We are basically shooting right at the goaltender instead of any open part of the net. Larkin back to Mata. Move Sherratt. Dylan Larkin in around. Larkin in front and a save again. Pad save Samsonov. Nylander as the power play trickles down. Matthews. Save from Husso. Larkin tried to get a stick in there. No. Matthews to bring it out of the box. Immediately got knocked down. Which is not great for his ability to get up ice here. Marner around Mata. Nylander and a save from Husso. Over to Perron. They're going to step up on David Perron. Dished it off to Oli Mata. And now Perron again. Broken play. William Nylander has followed the puck the entire way around the ice. Comfort cross ice. Perron scores 2-2. Two -two. Perron who got shoved in the back by William Nylander who was just, was just a pest. Wouldn't go away. Got up, went to the post, Comfort chases the puck down, and they leave Perron alone. That's what it takes, apparently, to get cross creasers to work in today's NHL. Late stages, period two, game two. Matthews, shot is blocked by Kane. Long one to Debrinkit. Debrinkit, final seconds in front, shot off of Patrick Kane. That'll be the period, but a late equalizer for Detroit. Period number three underway. 2-2, two -two, Detroit and Toronto. And Austin Matthews was looking to go straight up the middle. That shot in around Billy Husso. Larkin knocked it away from Marner. And a shot, I believe, from Nylander off of Wallman and over the glass. Jake Wallman and Shane Gostisbehere are best defenders as of right now, but because head coaches... Oh, God, that got free. Sherratt's got it. Up to Marner, or up... Deflected by Marner, rather. Yeah. They just carved us up. <clears throat> carved us up. Knocked down by Nylander as we tried to get it out of the zone, and then they just tic-tac-toe past their way once again, faster than the game allows the human to do. Oh, yeah. Tigers today. We just let off with Red Wings. Red Wings has been a, a tilting series as of late, so I figured I'd get the annoying part out of the way first. Morgan Riley hit hard by Sherratt. Larkin out wide to Ben Sherratt, who's on a breakaway, but Debrinket abandoned him. Sherratt shot, missed everything. Corralled by Debrinket. Kane a wrist shot. Wallman through traffic. <laughs> Through traffic, and Samsonov makes the easy glove save. He certainly made it look easy. We're getting destroyed in hits simply because they are wrecking us at every given opportunity. Bertuzzi going to get bullied down by Olimata. Gostas Bear is around. Long one to Comfort. Got stick lifted. 
Are we serious here? Comfort Amata. Looking for open passes. Out wide, Raymond. Tried to stop. Brody runs right through us. I tell you, the, the AI defenders, when you try to stop in the corner, they just they know where you're going the second you do. Comp a shot off of Huso. That's Tavares in behind. The shot from Bertuzzi is up in the air that sat right down in front. But now it's Gostaspear. Gets it out wide to Mata. Mata stops. To Gostaspear. Now Kopp. Andrew Kopp shoved. Mata through. Gostaspear through traffic. No. Wide of the net. Ryan Reeves hasn't had the puck much today. A back pass to the complete opposite side of the ice. Can't switch to the right player. Yarn Croak allowed to skate in. Overskated with Sprong. It's a save from Huso. Did not want that puck to Sprong. It's around to Fabry and up to Kopp. Andrew Kopp around Lily Egren. Back to Fabry. Fluttering shot. Does not go. Yarn Croak. We didn't come back here with Sprong. Not sure anybody would have. In front to Yarncroke. It's on the stick of McIsaac. And up to Alex Dabrinkit. Dabrinkit going to try and find Kane. He did. Oh, and it's another save from Sam Sonov in front. It's picked off by Reeves. Looking for Larkin on the post. Hole will turn up ice. Dabrinkit again. He gets hit. Puck bounces right to Matthews. Nylander around Kane, Austin Matthews straight up the middle. Puck knocked away, Kane. Hole, up to Dabrinkit, but he's out of gas. Dropping it back, Kane in front, loose in front, still with Dabrinkit trying to take the shot and it won't go. Riley, hit by Sherratt. Over to Rasmussen. Michael Rasmussen in front, Kane scores, 3-3. Three, three. Patrick Kane with two here in game number two. Did not have the best regular season since he joined Detroit. Did Patrick Kane, but man, huge here in game two. Face-off win from Joe Valeno. Tried to dump it off. That's picked off by Matthews. Now it's Nylander. Huge save from Billy Husso. Slipped up to Rasmussen. Who's around? In the middle is Bergen. He scores on the backhand and it's 4-3. Oh, man. I actually thought I messed up. I wanted to go to the forehand, forgetting what hand Bergen was. The shot would have been the same. That's where I wanted it. But the backhand beat Samson off. Oh, man. Playoff hockey. It is exhausting. As here's Rasmussen. Turning. Finding Sherratt, no. Went to Valeno instead. Rasmussen pinned to the board, so just kick this deep to be retrieved by Wallman. Jake Wallman dumping it off. Rasmussen, I tried to turn back, but that's where exactly where the puck was, and we're offside. Face-off win from Cop. <clears throat> Dished it off to Fabry. I didn't even see a poke check from Gambrell. Lafferty in. Poke checked away Sherrod. Andrew Cop with it. Up to Fabry. He's around Timmons. Looking. Cop couldn't find him. Giordano with the play. Here's Sprong looking. Fabry scores! 5-3! 
About time that this team's offense woke up. Kind of a funky play there. Not really sure what the Leafs were planning on doing. Um, I got nothing. McIsaac just going to dump it in. Fabry's got a chance. I don't know what happened over there. That was weird. Tavares with six and a half to play. He'll get clobbered. Fabry around. Sprong's over there. Didn't really have anybody to go to. Now McIsaac. Fabry over to Andrew Kopp. He gets pinned to the boards, but here's Jared McIsaac. Still with it. Tried to turn and take the shot. Still with McIsaac. Raymond stick lifted. Stays with it. Can't get the acceleration going with the Raven. This wouldn't skate. <clears throat> Intercepted by Bertuzzi, but poked away from hole. Overskated by Cop. And now it's with Toronto. McIsaac with a hit. On camp. Nylander picked off by Raymond. Perron. I don't know how they just managed to keep that in. Probably because they're about to score. Perron. Up to Lucas Raymond. Lucas Raymond. Empty net, so a penalty upcoming on the Toronto Maple Leafs. Perron plays it back to Justin Hole in the middle for Jared McIsaac. Save Samsonov. And the penalty will be called. It's interference on Tavares. Similar to the penalty that Robbie Fabry took in game number one. What the fuck was that? What? <laughs> Oh, uh, well, after a whole bunch of AI penalties that uh, were just completely stupid, we ain't going to complain about that one. Sprong keeps it in. Sprong shooting and a glove save Samsonov. That was a nice shot from Sprong. Face off one by Toronto Lilligren. You'd expect them to try and be aggressive. Lilligren just busts through. It's a save from Husso. We get that to Rasmussen. And now Kane. Kane drops that off. Sprong. Poke checked away from Rasmussen. Sprong, little backhand pass, Patrick Kane. Kane runs into Dylan Larkin. Larkin's shot. Off a body in front. Larkin tried to move it. Now it's with Rasmussen. Through traffic. Oh, right on the goalpost. Rasmussen. Sprong. Save. Samsonov. <clears throat> Rasmussen. The shot blocked. He's tied up with Reeves, but still with Michael Rasmussen. Dropped it off. Sprong over the net. Kane ran underneath the pockets with Alex to bring it, who takes a backhand shot. The puck is still loose, and it stays out. Two minutes, 30 seconds left here in game two. To bring it. May just be unobstructed. What are the Leafs thinking here? Oh, it's another save from Samsonov. Rasmussen scores, and it's a bottle knocker. What a four, what a third period for offense here. Samsonov tries the desperation save. An absolute snipe from Michael Rasmussen. The second Red Wing with his first playoff goal ever. And it's a three goal lead with two minutes to go. McIsaac. Plays that off to Hole. Hole drops it off. Perron in front. Samsonov another save. Offensive zone face off with a minute 35 to go. Face off win for Toronto. Klinkberg. Marner. 
Toronto needs something, then they need it fast. I don't know if dump-ins are going to be quite good enough. Raymond going to find Comfort. Good poke check on JT Comfort, but he's around Klinkberg for the time being. Don't really need more goals, just need to kill time. It's Hole, the shot, knocked down by Matthews. Perron made a nice play. Penalty, <laughs> no he didn't. I think it's going to be David Perron on a slash. It's here's Austin Matthews with a shot and a save by Huso. Let's see who goes off. It's actually Raymond. You know, it's funny. When we were at work earlier today, we uh, we saw who was on the mound, and I go, Scooble's going to allow one earned. Red uh, Tigers are going to score three. That's how the game's going to end. 3-1. They've already proved me wrong. Maple Leafs on the power play, but not much time to go. Bertuzzi, holy Mata, nearly put that in on his own. Mata across, finding Cop. They did not empty the net. Cop just going to play it around. Nearly turned into a breakaway for Toronto here at the Horn, but not like it's going to matter. Red Wings win game two. Was not an easy one by any means. 1-1, one, one, then 2-2. Two, two. Red Wings hold on to this one after a third period offensive onslaught. Goals from Bergeron, goals from Rasmussen. That goal from Rasmussen was just on a complete whim. I'm like, I don't know if he's got that in him. He did. We head to Toronto with a series tied.